I'm going to click on Read Trial Balance Data and select With Transactions because we're reading the general ledger data. For QuickBooks users, Excel FSM allows you to read QuickBooks directly, whether the desktop or online version. So I'm going to pick my 2015 trial balance. Again, I just exported this out of my accounting software into any format that Excel FSM can read. So I'm going to click OK. And now it's asking me to select another file because we also want to pull the general ledger in. I'm going to pick my 2015 general ledger, and it's the same thing. I just exported this out of my accounting software. So the general ledger is a bit more complicated for Excel to read. So we need to fill in these fields here to explain what's what. The general ledger from date or beginning date would be January 1st, 2015. And our first transaction row, let's see, that would be row three right here where we have a reference of 242 and a description and then an amount. The account description column, that's actually column A because that's where I see the account we're dealing with is checking. The number of rows above this first transaction is one if we exclude the headers, just the title of the account. And then for the ending balance, the debits and the credits are both in column G, so I'm going to indicate that by putting G in both debit and credit. And then we need to specify what each column stands for. The transaction date, that's easy, it's labeled date, so that's column B. And the transaction document must be this reference here in column C. The allocation account is labeled for us in column E. And then for each transaction, both our debits and credits are in one column, column F. There's one field on here we haven't accounted for, the description. I think that would be useful, so we'll add that here. Okay, we're done labeling. I'm going to click OK. And now the general ledger is going to be imported the same way that the trial balance is. Go to our website, excel-fsm.com, and download your 30-day free trial that lets you have a full version of the software for 30 days.